Friday evening at Ralph Engelstead Arena, top-ranked Minnesota defeated third-ranked North Dakota 5-1 in women's WCHA play. With Scott Koberinski, I'm Dan Hammer. This is your UNDSports.com post-game wrap. North Dakota got off to a strong start tonight, one nothing lead, but uh, Minnesota's special teams, the power play was big tonight. Three power play goals for Minnesota. Uh, definitely the difference, and North Dakota only had one power play and that was with two seconds left right. in the game. But when Minnesota got on the power play, they capitalized three for three tonight. And man, were they impressive moving that puck around. Let's take a look at the highlights. North Dakota got it on the board first in the first period. Becca Kohler was so good tonight in the opening frame for UND, and she tallies the game's opening goal. Oh, nice goal there, a nice forecheck as uh, Dolan gets that puck, fires it out front. Turnover there by Minnesota. Kohler capitalizes with a quick turnaround shot. Fourth of the year for Kohler. Minnesota's first power play goal here with Marianne Menifee tying the game. Yeah, nice uh, nice play there by Kelly going around the net. Right to Menifee, 1-1 uh, hockey game. Menifee's eighth of the year. We go to the second period. Minnesota just 44 seconds into the period. Great play by Sarah Davis winning the draw and setting up Kate Shipper. Very nice play by Davis. Put it right over there and uh, Shipper puts in her first of the night. Then at the 3.05 mark, a power play goal again for the Gophers this time. North Dakota blocks a shot. Lexi Shaw makes a save. UND blocks yet another shot, and finally Shipper bangs it in. Shipper's right there on the doorstep again and again. North Dakota blocked three or four shots, but Minnesota just kept pounding away, and they go up 3-1. Uh, to one. And Minnesota then with its third straight goal in the second period. Megan Lawrence gets the even strength goal. Nice goal there by Lawrence. She walks right out of the corner, picks the top one. And then uh, Minnesota's third power play goal of the night, Rachel Bonner with a rebound off her own attempt. That's a nice play by Minnesota. They go right off the goal line, attack the net, get the rebound, and put it in the empty net. 5-1 the final. Minnesota outshoots North Dakota 37-32. Minnesota had 11 win advantage in the faceoff circle and center iceman Kelly Terry was particularly strong for Minnesota there going 16 and 4. 5 won the final. Katie Hale caught up with North Dakota head coach Brian Adolski. Coach you uh, got the start you wanted a pretty good first period penalties really cost your team tonight. Oh absolutely I thought uh, penalty kill they just uh, ate us up and uh, you know, that's been a little point of contention and uh, something that definitely needs to be better tomorrow when we watch film and come out. You lost Friday night against the Gophers in, Mar or in Minneapolis, rather. You came back, you beat them on Saturday night. What are the takeaways from tonight to regroup and have a good night tomorrow? Well, I mean, we have a lot of pride in our locker room. There's no excuses about what happened today. We know we need to be better. and. Honestly, I was super excited by some of our younger kids and how they stepped up and played today. So, they need a better effort tomorrow. Definitely have the depth and but that in fresh, or excuse me, impressive freshman class. So, thank you so much, Coach, for your time. Appreciate it. Thanks, Katie. Dan and Cobra, I'll send it back upstairs to you. Thank you, Katie. Two teams will wrap up their series Saturday night at the Ralph. He's Cobra. I'm Dan. That's your UNDSports.com post-game wrap.